two-year-old Colt Pacers are stepping out of the paddock for this evening's fifth race. The second division of the Tompkin Gears for two-year-old Colt Pacers, a pace of one mile, a purse of $21,200. A field of eight, there are no changes, exact to a trifecta wagering. Here are the parading Pacers. The one Bacotti Hanover, owned by Barbara and Robert Kronitsky of Butler, Pennsylvania, trained and driven by Ray Paver. Number two is Mighty Pacific. The lessees are Joe and Joanne Thompson of Chesapeake City, Maryland, trained by Mark Clark, Jim Daly. The three is Thin Blue Line, owned by the Oldfield Farm Incorporated of Sand Creek, Michigan, trained by Richard Oldfield with Bob Harper. The four is Pocket Aces, owned by Barnett Zimmerman, Limited Liability Corporation of Deerfield, Illinois, trained by Virgil Morgan, Jr., Brett Miller at the lines. Number five is Hawaiian Hunk, owned by Lawrence Geary of Ada, Michigan, trained by Todd LaFontaine, the K-Man, King Kaufman. The six, Come On Alibi, owned by White and Rideout. They're the Hoosier State, trained by Doug Rideout with Chip Noble. Number seven, Casati Connection, owned by Ron Bates of Amanda, Ohio, trained by Tom Blake and Chip Dan Noble. And with the outside of the eight, Kublai Pan, owned by the Peter Pan Stables Incorporated of Pepper Pike, Ohio, trained by Ivan Sugg, J. Duke Sugg, and the Sulky. That's the field for the fifth race, the second division of the Tompkin Gears, two year old Colt Pace. Fifth race, second division of the Tompkin Gears, two year old Colt Pace, all moving in behind the gate, eight on gate. Well, the Albert starting gate makes that patented swing into the back stretch and they're getting set for a start. This field is in motion. They're off then, pacing and powering off the wings of the starting gate. There goes the five Hawaiian hunk of the K-Man has sent this one directly to the frontier. Up on the inside, coming away in two, thin blue line, driving up Kublai Pan is also on the go. They're racing in fourth, looking to be angled in. That has come on Alibi, just ahead of Bugatti Hanover in fifth. Sixth on the inside, that's Pocket Aces and the two trailers here. Mighty Pacific and Casade Connection can see them all. As they step towards the initial quarter and Kublai Pan on the front end here for Duke Sugg through the opening quarter at 27 and four fives. Up on the inside, thin blue line is landed the garden spot, racing into there, little rough gated. Inside in third, Hawaiian hunk has been shuffled back there in three. Fourth on the inside, come on, Alibi. First up on the outside in five, that is pocket aces. Pendant at the pylons in six, Bugatti Hanover. Second over the outside of there in seventh, Mighty Pacific and third over in trailing the field. Cup. Casate Connection. As they step around the clubhouse turn in front of the paddock and on over to the half, being led by Kubai Pan on the front end tier. Kubai Pan reports to the half in 58 and two fifths. Off the turn and driving down the back side. Heads are pointed towards three quarters, being led by Kubai Pan and leading it tier for Duke Sug by a length and a half. Grinding it out first over the outside in two. That is Pocket Aces along the pylons in third. That is Thin Blue Line. Second over the outside racing in fourth there. As they step towards the three quarter mile mark of the race, that that is Mighty Pacific pending at the pylons in five. Hawaiian hunk. Third over on the outside in six. Casade connection. Three quarters in one twenty-seven and two fives. They'll pace the final turn and head for home. And Kublai Pan still there on the front, leading it by a length and a half. And to the outside, bearing down in two pocket aces and awaiting the passing lane. That's thin blue line and off the pylons. High Hawaiian hunk to the top of the stretch. Less than an eighth of them how to pace and they're on their way home. Driving through Power Alley on top of the field with the lead Kublai Pan. But Thin blue line is charging hard, but too late here. Coop White Pan takes the second division of the Tompkin Gears for two-year-old Colt Pacers. Finishing second to three. Thin blue line. Third was the sixth. Come on, Alibi. Time of the mile, 155. Two fifths. Coop White Pan, a first career victory. And stepping track side of the winner's circle in the first career victory, taking the second division of the Tompkin Gears for two year old Colt Pacers, timed at 155 and 2. Here's the 8 Kublai Pan, a two year old black Colt by the Panderosa out of a Matt Scooter Mare, Mystical Matty, owned by the Peter Pan Stables Incorporated of Pepper Pike, Ohio, trained by Ivan Sugg, nicely handled here this evening by winning driver Duke Sugg. The 8 Kublai Pan, first career victory. Comes in 155, two fifths as he captures Tompkin Gears action for two year old Colt Pacers, the second division.